Okay, you guys. So I wanted to do a video for you um, where I'm going to be tapping, scratching, and just soft-spoken, um, basically following up with my video about my big update for the channel of opening the comment section. So I just wanted to follow up with that and just give you guys a few updates and respond to some of your questions and things like that that you've been asking. So, first and foremost, I wanted to say thank you so much for um, like all of your support. It's like you guys are really, really, uh, like really, really nice. <laughs> Thank you so much for all of your comments and all of your support. I love having the comment section open finally. Um, uh, if, you, if you don't know all the reasons why I was not able to before, feel free to go and watch um, a video put out, uh, probably looking back a month or so from this video coming out. It says big channel update on it. Um, yeah, check that out if you want to understand the reasons why, but I'm so excited that I can have the comment section open now. Um, it's so awesome because before I could, I could like interact with you guys through certain avenues, um, like, um, the discuss, discuss it, I can't say the word, discussion board, and the, uh, there's some private messaging options and things like that that some of you knew of. So I got to interact with you, uh, quite a few of you actually that way. But this is really cool because I get to interact with so many more of you and it's, you know, it, I just, I love it. I'm so, I'm so glad that um, I'm able to do that now. It's been working really well, so I plan on continuing to do it. Um, and uh, yeah, my husband, like I said, has helped me and it's been really great. So what we do is we sit down together and we open up each each video's comments and just read them and allow them um, again if you want to understand why go ahead and watch that past video I just mentioned because otherwise probably most of this won't make much, much sense to you um, but uh, it's been really cool sitting there together and uh, we read them and approve them together um, it's great because because I actually get to read every single comment that way um, I apologize that it, it does take us a little bit longer to um, get to them and approve them so some of you will come to my channel and be like okay I, I made a comment but I can't see my comment um, or, or there's no comments at all still because we haven't actually gotten to go ahead and approve them so the only problem is you know you don't really see them right away often some nights we can do it right away but um, if we have things going on and we, we can't do it right then you have to wait kind of like to see your comment and other people's comments which I'm sorry about that's that's a bummer but it's kind of the best way we found to do it, so I'm just glad it's working, and um, I'm I'm seeing all of your comments. If, if some of your comments have not been approved yet, it's because we still have tons we have to go through. There are so many you can't even imagine. So um, I I hope we are we are plug plugging on through. I don't think that's even a saying, but you know you get the idea. Let's see. Uh, this is my journal, and. I'm just gonna, I made some notes to remember to answer some of your questions that you asked. Um, so here are my scribble notes. Um, I had someone ask me if I, they, they, I think um, people had mentioned, do you have a Patreon account? Um, they thought I didn't, but I actually do have one. Um, so if you're interested in giving to my channel, that would be awesome if you want to donate. Um, if you're not familiar with what Patreon is, it's basically a way to give to content creators on YouTube and other platforms um, that basically just put out content for you um, but don't really make much from doing it. So um, it's really helpful for us. So myself and other ASMR artists really benefit from it. We really appreciate it. Um, I try to give, I, it sounds like a small amount, but it really matters. I, I've committed to giving $1 per month um, to five different ASMR artists consistently. And um, it's, like I said, it seems small, but it's really not, guys. If you can give $1 a month to an ASMR artist that you want to support, and 
everyone does that then it really adds up you know and everyone gives a little bit but everyone gets a lot from it so um, that's something that I had put out as a challenge to you guys in a past video and I myself did it um, so that's been neat to be able to support some artists in fact if you're an ASMR content creator and you don't have a patreon you should make one because I went to go and try and support so many people and I couldn't find them some of my favorites aren't, aren't actually on patreon so I was kind of bummed um, I still gave to channels that I love um, and want to support but some of my favorites I, I couldn't find on there kind of, sometimes I have some smaller channels that I really love so maybe they don't have patreon but anyway if you want to give in that way patreon is a monthly donation platform so you can choose to give a dollar a month three dollars a month five dollars a month some people even give like 10 and 15 which blows my mind and I want to give a shout out to you thank you so much you have no idea how helpful that is thank you um, you go to my home channel and there's a orange P at the top right you can see um, there's actually a blue P for PayPal and there's an orange P for Patreon so you can give through Patreon or if you just want to give a one-time gift which a lot of you have given me five dollars here and there which is so helpful thank you so much you could just go to PayPal and just do a one-time gift no problem so there's both options so yes I do have a Patreon page I wanted to make sure you guys knew that um, and a huge thank you to all of you who have come and donated um, one-time gifts through PayPal and our monthly donators through Patreon. Thank you so much. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and scratch a candle for you guys on this next as I share some more things. But I know you love the candle scratching and tapping. Whenever I give update videos, I tend to talk faster because I get excited, so I'm sorry, I'll try to be calmer. <laughs> Many of you asked me questions about my hands. Thank you so much for your concern. Um, I have uh, nerve damage along my ulna nerve on both hands from my past job over typing in a bad position um, and basically uh, a lot of you were like giving suggestions which was so sweet um, so that you know yes I do use voice activation when I do all of my any emails I have to do a typing of any sort during my day um, I always use my I have like a headphones I put in and I have a a thing on my computer where I can speak the words I want to say instead of typing them but as many of you have noticed often there's like auto correcting and I don't notice and it writes something really funny like in the description box or something so if you ever see that it's because I did it with my voice and when I looked back I didn't notice the the auto corrected change it or something like that to some weird word so that's just funny sorry about that um, but yes I do use that um, and I love the question about you know how does tapping affect your hand you know um, I remember when I went to go make my very first ASMR video I thought to myself I let's try this this could very easily hurt my hand because um, I didn't know I hadn't ever made a video before and it felt like hey this movement I would think it would hurt my hand because like when I type that triggers uh, pain for me significant I can only type for like a very short period of time without it aggravating it so um, I thought this would surely affect it but it's but it doesn't and after I made my first video I remember telling my husband how weird it didn't hurt my hand at all like um, people have asked if, if it did hurt and, and so no it doesn't thank you for your concern um, and I honestly don't know why I wonder if there are any physical therapists out there that understand um, this nerve and the way that it works you know when you're typing you you're really putting pressure um, even though I can feel it um, and also the mouse movement for some reason any any really small motor skills with this part really irritate it. Even writing, I unfortunately love to journal, but 
I can't anymore. Like I have to make really small scribbles. I can't really write out very much, which is a real bummer. And I like to draw in my journals and so I'm really, that's a bummer. But um, yeah, writing really hurts, typing really hurts, but typing does not. In fact, I've had some friends mention when I brought that up, they said, yeah, I wonder if it actually strengthens the, the muscle in there or something movement because it's so light they wonder if actually it might even improve my nerve damage I have no idea but that would be nice I'm really grateful that it doesn't hurt because I can make so many videos for you guys and not have to worry about that Otherwise, truly, I, I wouldn't be able to make ASMR videos. So just wanted to give you guys a, an update for those of you who donated to um, something I'm doing called Harvest Pack. I've mentioned it in a couple of videos. Um, I'm doing something where I'm raising money to, for a, an organization that packs nutritious meals for um, basically the starving around the world. So it's a really cool organization. So I'm still raising the money for this endeavor. Um, I, was, I was actually hoping to have been doing my um, packing date uh, either in May, but I'm actually doing a big fundraiser in May, so I have a feeling that my packing date will be pushed back a little bit, but it's still pretty good. I'm still glad I've got my, I'm doing a big fundraiser, um, trying to bring all the people in my life together for raising money for this endeavor. Sorry, there's a train. I usually cut it out, but since I'm talking with you guys, I'll just point it out. Um, yeah, so I am still raising funds for it, so those who donated, I it's definitely, I've got your donations and they are going towards it and I'm super excited. May 13th is the day I'm doing a fundraiser, so um, yeah, pray that goes well. I really pray I raise a lot. The more we raise, like, the more people get fed. In fact, if you still want to donate towards it, I had made a cutoff date um, because at the time I really wasn't sure when I would be doing the actual packing day um, because now I know and still have my fundraiser date in May that my packing date probably won't be until June or so. Um, something like that. So, uh, if you still want to donate, you can technically still do that through PayPal or Patreon. You just have to put uh, how much of your donation you want to go towards Harvest Pack. And Harvest Pack is Harvest, H-A-R-V-E-S-T, Pack, P-A-C-K. Yeah, I'll write it down for you. Some writing sounds on my candle wax. This Barely get it into the camera out there. So that's what it's called. Anyway, so I just wanted to update those of you who donated um, and thank you again for your donations. I'm hoping the May 13th fundraiser that I'm doing goes really, really well. My goal is to raise $4,000, um, which feeds. Uh, over 15,000 people. Pretty amazing, right? It's because every, um, they've changed it to 25 cents now. It used to be every 23 cents provides one meal. It's 25 cents now, but that's still really good. So yeah, if I raise it's something like $3,875, so almost 4,000, it provides 15,000 meals. And if you want to hear more about that, I have a video 
on that. I'll try to put that in the description box for you. I'm so bad at that, but I will try to. It's amazing, like, when channels can do that. Like, they put, like, everything they talk about comes up in, like, the description box or, like, pops up on the screen. That'd be cool if one day I figured out how to do that. Not so much how, I think it's the time. Getting the time to be able to do it and the hand problem. It's difficult. So forgive me that I don't always have those great lengths for you. I think about it and wish that I could, but it's just not possible right now. so many people requesting more talking videos. Um, I know some of you really prefer no talking. In fact, I think most of you subscribed to my channel um, would prefer no talking, but then there's like suddenly a large group of you who are really wanting more talking, so I'm trying to get more, um, trying to do a few more talking videos when I record for you guys so that there's something for everyone. I think I just recently hit my 400th video that I made. Isn't that crazy? Because um, my channel has only been up since technically I put my first video up in June two years ago. So this June will be two years. And there are 400 videos. I, I surpassed putting 400 up uh, just recently. some updates for you guys. Um, I'm loving the comment section is the main thing I wanted to say and just really, you know, a really big thank you to you guys for um, taking the time to watch my videos and commenting. It's, it's really fun to get to um, connect with you guys that way so I love it and I hope you guys are doing really well and yeah, blessings on you and uh, I hope you get some good sleep. Good night. <laughs>